he really broke um kind of broke the chains of the system and it, in in um in mongolia there's this notion of um two, kind of two types of royalty black boned and, and um white boned and he was always on the wrong side of nobility it's like your stepfather was the khan you're just kind of the last dude left alive from your tribe the last eldest kind of not really his son um so you're not really noble if they wanted to they could always slur him and the properly full-blooded nobility well they're always very petty about things and he he literally had his entire life destroyed had nothing built it back up and so everything was good to him everything he had was good to him he never even though he his famous quotes about you know when you're hungry and you eat your appetite keeps growing um like a ravenous character he also did weirdly did not covet what other people had he coveted them to go the fuck away stop trying to take what's mine stop attacking me and you'll see over and over again whether it was good politics or actual history he reacts to you know like arguably his his reason for invading china you know and yeah. conquering the jerk and jin and you know eventually um, burning Beijing is because of historical wrongs against Mongolians and the continued telling us to send tribute and telling us to do what you want and making us weak and small and turning against each other. <laughs> <laughs> 